is that people are focused on the science. They're focused on, you know, well, what's made up the algorithm? Why is my content not getting the same reach? If it's not getting the same reach, or, you know, what has changed to give me more reach? And I actually think, or we actually believe the, the, the conversation should shift to the art. And what's exciting for me is that um, you guys in the room have a disproportionate advantage over any other brand because you're the best creators of content in the world. And if you do that right, then the algorithm change goes away. And the idea of using behind the scenes video or production stills, um, I think we're moving into a world where there needs to be a little bit more of a strategy behind the content you put on the platform. Because um, I think you need to keep in mind that you know, your content is competing with a picture of my daughter, right? right? And that's, I think, sometimes lost in the idea of marketing television on Facebook. And if you can create content um, that people want to engage with, um, people will share it. At the end of the day, users are the, are the final judge and jury of what is social. Yeah. And I think taking a little bit more time to craft the content that goes out um, will you know, dissipate any algorithm change that has, has occurred. And with that, you know, with, the, with the algorithm changes, you know, kind of the, the creative content, you know, how, many, how many souls the decks are taken you know, for fans and things like that. But how has, how is, how is paid media, how, how have networks used paid media on Facebook to really build out a brand and build out an audience? I know Dallas was one example, but what's yeah. the other way they use paid media? So, you know, part of